All right. I had a dude the other day said, man, we need to see more of the cooking videos. I want to see, you know, I want to see you make a cobbler on blackberry cobbler. Woke up this morning. I said, I'm fixing to go out there and see if I can't find enough because they're just now getting ripe. You know, the wild ones are just getting ripe. And, um, you know, there's a pile of red ones, which we'll turn up. We'll make preserves and stuff out of those later on. But uh, all I needed was two cups of blackberries, you know. And I said, well, I, I, surely I can find that. So I went out there and I got to picking and uh, I probably got three or four cups. So all I got to do is like add, you know, if I've got more, just add that much more to the recipe to make a, a bigger cobbler because around here, I promise you, it ain't going to waste. We're going to eat it. But anyway, oh, you can do these cobblers. You know, you always think of a cobbler being peach or whatever, which not bumping a peach cobbler because like, hey, you don't get no better than that right there. That and some vanilla ice cream and let me tell you, you hurt yourself. But oh, you can make them blackberries, dewberries, which I missed out on the dewberries. They came in earlier and I didn't get a chance to get out and pick those. I think I really like those better. They're bigger and a little bit sweeter than the uh, than the uh, blackberries. Look right here coming. Yeah. Are you using that tripod like a selfie stick? Yeah, well, that's all I got. Anyway, that's all I got. But anyway, me and Hannah, we fixing to go in here right now. She's ready. This is my assistant anyway. We've got probably three cups of blackberries and we fixing to go in there and put this thing together and see what it tastes like. About lunchtime, Hannah, you reckon we'll... I'm hungry right now. Yeah, me too. But maybe we can, uh, maybe we can get it. I don't know, I, ain't, I don't know about no vanilla ice cream, so vanilla ice cream be, be the bomb then. Tell Lisa to pick up some ice cream. Yeah. But anyway, that's what we fixing to do. We fixing to show y'all how we make it down here in the South anyway. And uh, I think it's gonna be good. Anyway, we'll talk to y'all in a little bit. We're going to set it up and get the uh, ingredients out there. Are you eating my blackberry, girl? I'm no. eating the blackberries. <laughs> we'll talk to y'all in a little bit. All right. Here we go. We got the all-purpose flour. We got sugar. We got milk. All right, she said one cup. Right? One cup. One cup flour. Yep. We got this the butter the over here melting. That's a blackberry cobbler. All right, that's all the flour we need, right? Yep. I'm going to get that out of the way because we got a little bitty kitchen. We got a little bitty kitchen. All right, and now it is one and a fourth cup plus two tablespoons of granulated sugar. That's crazy, isn't it? Yep. Oh, I like y'all's canisters. Ew. One and a quarter cup. Yep. You said grease these pans, right? Yep. All right. You can use butter or whatever on these pan on these skillets. All right. We don't we, we can't find our big skillet. So what we're gonna do is improvise. We're gonna possibly use uh, both of these skillets. You know, both of these small skillets. You remember we were looking for that one with the crack in it? That's the one with the crack. In it. Anyway, I'm gonna put some butter flavored oh non-stick on here can't believe how much sugar this mess has in it yeah well hey sugar that's, that's what i was telling them to go sugar makes everything good huh? yeah no one butter and sugar let me tell you mm. all right you done with sugar yep i'm gonna get it out of the way one and a half teaspoon of baking powder eyeball this whole measuring thing. Yeah, well, and, and we can me. too. We just... I can't. I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all. What you going to need to whip that up with? Give me a spoon. Spoon? Yep. Salt. How much we salt? We need half a teaspoon of salt. Doesn't matter what can. We had to have the wife send the recipe. That's why we're... Yeah, it's on Pinterest. And, you know, Pinterest is the bomb for all recipes. I don't think you know what Pinterest is, but... Who, me? Yeah. That it? Yep. So you mean? Yep. Yep. Mm. Or you can just play it by ear and start putting some stuff together, you know. Yeah. 
as long as you got, you know, three tons of sugar. Yeah, if you butter. got, yeah, you got 50 pounds of sugar in it, it's going to be good, y'all. It's going to be good. That's what this is. Yeah. All right, how much milk or butter first? It don't matter. I don't and I mounted a whole stick of butter in the it microwave. Says add the milk first, but I don't never. I don't really see how all that matters. But just a cup, cup of whole milk. Yep. All right, then. Butter. Get that out of the way. We need to get a cow, don't we, Kia? Yeah. That's a a cool. milk cow? Yeah, a milk cow. That's 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 the only way to go. And right. a little horse. Anyway, mounted the whole stick of butter and then, oh, uh, do you mix the, you gonna put the butter in there too? Yep. In here? Yep. Okay. Hmm. What it says. You want to do it now or you want to do it later? Now. All right. And then let it cool. You know, the butter, let it cool a little yeah, bit. Yeah, melt it and let it. Let it sit. I don't know why. Whisk until smooth. Whisk. This after right here is the, a whisk. After you add the butter. I'm going to get it halfway stirred a little bit first. Because you're supposed to whisk it. After you add the butter. Yeah. Yes. So I'm going to. I just wanted it you know, to where the flour was and still. You take your whisk and clean that off if you need to. Y'all ever seen somebody get hit with a wood spoon? Yeah, well, hey, look here. You better be careful what you're doing now. I got the skillet back here. Oh yeah, we got the oven preheated to 350. So we are ready on that right there. Got the blackberries right there. We had uh, ended up having three, three full cups of blackberries. So. Uh, yeah, I'd ask you to read what's next on the recipe. I can't, I can't see what my glasses. So. Yeah. Yeah. Let me whisk that. Let me whisk that while you while you looking at that. Pour the whisk. batter into the grease pan dish. It's whisked. Look at that. Smooth, smooth. Woo! Can't you smell it cooking? Hannah's starving to death this morning too, so works out good. All right, pour. You think we uh we might can make it with this one pan? Watch it rise and come out. I think it's gonna make it. I'd give you the spoon for pouring, but well, I got one of these right now. Yeah, that's gonna be nice. You know one of these little things right here? Hey, something else, ain't it? That thing will clean it up, boy. Pour it in there. Look at there. Pretty. Pour it in there. Really? Mm. Well, it just says scatter the top with all the blackberries. What or no, huh? That is a lot. I've never made a cobbler. I guess all the dough will rise. This poor little skillet. It's full now, y'all. Yo. We got a leaf in here, too. Right? Nah, it's just a little stem. It'll be all right. At least it ain't a stink bug. It'll have been a stink bug. You push them down in there? It doesn't say to. It just says pull them over the top. i tell you what. Me <laughs> and Hannah, okay, with this right here, me and Hannah are better at eating it than we are at making it. But I've never made a cobbler. Yeah, I ain't either. We're, I'm always the one in charge of the meat and stuff. So, hey, I'm not good with the, with the dessert, but... I'm That's better it. with chocolate stuff. Now we take a little, we take a, uh, we take a little bit of sugar and sprinkle over the top of that. <coughs> and it's probably gonna blow up, rise up out of there, and blow all over the uh, stove because I put it all in one pan in one skillet instead of putting it in two. But let me tell you, cast iron. Cast iron makes us makes a yo uh, makes well, everything see. taste better. Let's just put one more okay. on there. Diabetes friendly. Yep. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now you stick it in the oven. Stick it in the oven. And bake until the edges are golden and crispy for 50 to 60 minutes. I guess that'll go down in there. Pick your 60 minutes. All right, we got it in there. Let's see how it turns out. We'll see y'all in an hour or 50 or 60 minutes or whatever. I'll set a timer. And uh, let's see what this thing looks like and maybe get to try it. So I'm getting hungry. It's getting about that time. It's almost 10 o'clock. Talk to y'all in a little bit. 50 minutes. All right, here we go. We had to go a little bit over an hour. What was it, Hannah? Probably 15 minutes over, I guess, Maybe. because of the cast iron pan and, you know, skillet. We put too much in it, so it's going to be thick. It's actually running over the top, which is Hannah's fault because she didn't use the other skillet. Right, Hannah? Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it looks, uh, it looks good other than it running over a little bit. Okay, look at that right there. I don't know if y'all can see it, but look at that. All right. Look, him. Yeah, it looks good. Whoo! Let me turn that thing off here. All right. Blackberry Cobbler, you see it. Well, it just barely went over the edge. Look, I mean, it's just barely. We don't have any vanilla ice cream. We do have some butter pecan. Let's uh, let's try some of that. Mm. Oh yeah, look at that right there. I got a spider web on my spoon. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. See that? Perfect. Get down. Like I said, you can make this with strawberries, blueberries, peaches, oh, dewberries, blackberries. I mean, I don't know what all you can make cob out of, but uh, this is blackberry. Straight up the pan. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I didn't know. I thought, no. you, I thought he was putting ice cream in the pan. <laughs> I was like, all right. I said, we're really getting primitive with it now. <laughs> He's spreading that Corona all around. <laughs> Ooh. See, I got that cool ice cream, the coolest That's hot That's about thing. to be my breakfast, too. That's your breakfast right here. Only gain about 200 pounds. Mm. No, we did good. You did good. I didn't do that. No, you did too. You did it. You did as much as I did. I just Let me tell you it. something, folks. I don't know if it's a southern thing, but if you hadn't tried this right here, try it. Try it with something. Let me tell you, it is so good. They got like 14,000 different recipes for it on Pinterest. So. Yeah. Yeah, but you, or you can just use the one that we used, and it's good, too. Or you can just play it by ear, and, and uh, but let me tell you. Mm. While we was waiting on this, I was eating catfish that I caught yesterday. So this is my dessert right here. How do you eat what? Yep, waiting on this. He's just waiting on something all the time. Mmm. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all. If it'll even save.